Mommies are boring. Wait, uh -huh. are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Episode okay. thirty one. <laughs> last time on Fobbies of Orange, the chosen three slam jammed. Arabian people mispronounce names from their own heritage, and this episode will suck. This week on Orange. <laughs> you dance like a monkey. You dance like a shut up. Friends, the pyramids are open. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, seriously, Pill, your excitement is getting a little bit old, okay? We, like, no. You know what? You know what? We're not going in there at all. No. Bad idea. Look, it's dark and horrible. We're gonna die. No, I danced. We're going in there. Paula, get over it already. I'll PSI flash and you'll be able to see or something. No, shut up and let's go. No, Ness, I dance what I believe in as a feminist and as a woman and as a person and... No, we're not doing that. Voila! This inside is filled with our ancient relics of our history that will aid us in our super duper adventure time. We absolutely must go. We talk to the puppy man. We made the kraken become normal again, which still consisted of living people's arms off and breathing fire upon people, but also it says in the player's guide. Whoa, 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 poo, 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 poo. What are you doing? I, no, 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 poo, 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 poo. What? Are, you're, you're, you're bending the. Poo, you're bending the page. My, 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 poo, you're my, my player's guy. Give me the friggin' player's guy to rip out your eyeballs and place them with knife noodles and then rip out your face thrice and wipe my glasses with them, which is counterproductive, which will give Tony an excuse to clean my glasses at the end of the game, which I know he wants to do because it's my player's guide and it's mine and I read it. I can act like I'm super angry too. Why am I angry that I need PP? Alternatively, here, have it back. Yay. Well, now that that horrific incident of terror is over, how about we just go into the pyramid? This entire trip has been a horrific incident of terror, and your life will be a horrific incident of death if we go into this pyramid, Ness. <sighs> Fine. Would you do it for a Scooby snack? Because you're like a dog. Guys, Paula doesn't look too happy. I'm going to hide in the pyramid now, okay? Yes! Look at it, guys! Uh, yep, uh, I'm out. Wait up, Pooh. <laughs> you guys are wusses. I think we're on some sort of trapdoor. Um, how do you know? Because it's labeled trapdoor. Oh, snap! We are falling friends! Hmm. What is that thing? It looks kind of like some sort of a jelly bean. Nah, uh, that looks like the eye of a bird. You are familiar with these things? How, Mr. Ness? Well, this one time I was beating a living tar out of a crow with my baseball bat, and he started to come apart, and his eye looked like that. Also, I found a cookie in his remains, so I ate it. You're a strange child, Ness. I'm a kid, not a child, Paula. 
Childs or small kids? I'm a big kid now. You've graduated into Huggies. Congratulations. So, you should take the barrel die, yes? I'm not touching a, a, that thing with my hands. Or a 10-foot pole. Or an 11-foot pole. They don't make 11-foot poles. They come in increments of 5 feet. Shut up! I was just making a point. I understand that, but it was funny, so I said it. It was only funny to you, Jeff. Actually, no. I, I didn't come right out and laugh out loud. I, I was thinking in my head that it was a pretty funny joke. I liked it, Jeff. Thanks. I grabbed it, friends! It's slippery in my hand, so I put it in my pocket. Uh, can we go now? I'm tired of being the smelly tomb of death and snakes and death. And snakes. And death. There's an exit sign over there. It's illuminated in bright red letters. Let's follow the arrow. Okay, let's do it. Finally, back in the open air, I can breathe again. You can breathe in there, unfortunately. Whoa, what's that up in the sky? <gasps> it's the bird! It's a plane. No, 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 it's an Asian man! Pooh, I know you don't understand. Partially because I'm being very vague on purpose, but you need to come with me. Pooh, I know you don't understand. Partially because of me. I know. I just said that. Listen, you are to learn a great power. One that has never been seen before. The power of the Star Storm. You mean like Lucas has in Brawl? Well, no. I mean, technically, but... Listen, Pooh, you just need to come with me now. I'm teleporting back to Delam. I'll see you soon. Well, friends, it looks like this is goodbye. I must go learn of this new power and become who my father always wanted me to be. Okay. Goodbye, everyone. I'll miss you. See ya. Uh-huh. that guy? I don't know. More like, who's that? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Did she see us? Well, you know, she's coming this way, so I'd say yes. Okay. Alright, we gotta get out of here. Cut, get, cut. Do that stupid work. Okay. Um. the second time we've used that particular clip. Hmm, well, we've got nothing done this week, but someone's alive, unfortunately, and we've journeyed through the great, great pyramids of Scalaba. Where to next, Chosen uh, 3? Will Pooh be okay? Will Paula ever kill Trisha? Seriously, why isn't she dead? Gosh, find out next week on... Bobby's of Orange! <laughs> I just sneeze on radio. All right. Hey guys. Um. Pooh, I know you don't understand. Shut up. You no, know what? No, 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 no. Understand. <laughs> no. Who? No. I know you don't understand. No, no, that wasn't even my fault. Like they forgot to record a line. So like I did the first one. I was like, oh crap, this isn't, this isn't it. And then I. I, I went with it. You did, and I still screwed it. Up. I Pooh, still I know screwed you it up. Understand. Shut up. Sorry. <laughs> It was so funny. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty annoying.